Hello everyone, today we are going to change the LCD on Mate 20 light. Previous one had screws there, this one does not have it. Let's heat it up from the back and first thing first remove the SIM card tray. heat both sides see which side it opens easy just uh, insert any tool that you are comfortable with a card guitar pick or because it has glue and you're going to heat up again and again until you feel like it's loosened it looks like glass or plastic I, once I open it then I'll know I'm gonna heat up more mostly um, here and there there are the sensor button flexi so once you have opened it half or more be careful don't go much on top with this or any tool that you're using just stick the corner in there and work it out around if you need more heat heat it up beside of breaking something it is plastic here I still can't figure it out This is the flexi that I was talking to you about, the touch sensor flexi. We're going to release the touch uh, that your sensor, fingerprint sensor. Remove these two screws. Once the screws are out. Remove the plate. It's more like P30 light other day I changed on this one P30 light. Gives you arrow that there's no plastic to plastic. Uh, I did do a little bit of push and it came out with some sort of flexi <laughs> that's your ringer vibrator and all those kind of things I'm going to release the touch for the purpose that we open at this time we're going to disconnect the battery also now it's going above the battery so we don't need to remove the battery is that the that is lcd yeah so we don't need to remove the battery we're going to open this there's one screw here there's a small hook kind of thing which is holding this It's out, LCD is released. Not yet. We'll release it and take out the plane. One, two, three, four, five screws for your ringer, vibrator and charging bin so we can take out the flexi and then we're going to start heating up on the top. So it was easy to heat up from the back. And I think that is a thing you should do because now if you remove this then you still have to open the back so first open the back now i'm going to unscrew all these screws once all the screws are out just be careful about this flexi okay now this is out when i was opening the p light p30 light the other day 
I removed this but I don't think so that you need to do that now we can go to the front section and start heating up this so we can remove the LCD look for the cracky parts it's a little bit harder so you can insert something under it from that side not to leave the marks this thing gonna come out I think in pieces so here I'm going to stick my If you need to heat it more, heat it. It's gonna come out in pieces. I'm gonna heat a little bit more. more. Let's put our tweezer under it. I see, I can see now. So putting, let's try to insert it again. Sorry about that, I mistakenly hit the back button on my phone. But I'll merge the video later on. I'm gonna heat up more. I now heated it up, managed to put, insert this. When it's in pieces, so it will be real difficult to remove the battery. Give it a little bit more heat. So now, after giving a little bit more heat, it's coming out. LCD is out now. I'm just gonna clean on the sides where the excess glass is left. Once it is clean, there is nothing left. There's LCD now. We're going to check the LCD first. If it is working properly. P30 light also opens like the same procedure. So if this phone was quite low on power, so let me put it on charging first. For that I have to connect this back. Once we tested it then we can put the fingerprint sensor also. I'm gonna leave it on charging for few minutes so I can test the uh, LCD so LCD is working now you can start closing it Just power it off. Now before I close it, this uh, speaker cover cushion is LCD. You have to take it out from the old LCD that thing to put it there. After putting the small mesh of the speaker, I'm going to disconnect the LCD so I can put glue in front. I have put glue as you can see shiny stuff. 
I'm going to put the LCD. Gently just press it so it can stick to its position. No. The LCD connector with the battery connector back. Sorry for the mess, I was repairing another while it was charging. Let me just quickly see where it is bottom and top piece. So now the ringer cover is back and we are going to connect the fingerprint sensor also sorry about the shaking small things sometimes they get very stubborn once that sensor is there we're going to put the plate back I'm gonna pause here so it mustn't waste time. I'm going to put this in that uh, option here. I'm going to tie the screw. So once you're done with the top screws, all plates are back. Then you put all the screws there. This one was still sticking, so I'm not gonna use the glue here. Just gonna put some rubbers so it can hold the glue. That's how we're gonna change the P Mate 20 light LCD. If you like it, please share, subscribe. Any suggestion, please leave it for me. Thank you very much. Goodbye until next time.